All right, so we finally got our fourth and fifth battery in. And I'm going to go through installing it right now by myself with 125 pound batteries. So let's see how well this goes. First things first, let's get the inverter off. Oops. So that was the easy part. <laughs> Remember, lift with your knees. Legs, not knees, sorry, lift with your legs. <laughs> Make sure it's in the little grooves, which it sure is. Slide you in. All right. And again, these are 125 pounds a piece, so would I recommend getting some help? Oh yeah. Unfortunately, I don't have any, so. All right. Oh, this one's the strap. I forgot about that. Ah, oh, figures this one's turned the other way. Son of a chicken. Mm. Oh. there for the moment. Get you out of the way.
All right. Again, lift with the knees. All the way down. All the way up. There we go. And of course, turn this one around. There we go. You drop in the groove there. Now you did. Perfect. Awesome. Get these opened up. Get you plugged in. All right, and put everything back. There we go. All right. Now let's just put the inverter back on. That's the worst part is the stack is so high now. It's like you got to lift it so much higher. There you go. Back into the grooves. Perfect. All right. Back in. Let's lock it back down. And they're all locked. Yep. All right. Can't get my fingers in there. All right. Now I'm going to roll this back in to its resting spot. <laughs> Yeah, once you have this many, it's this many batteries. It's definitely not the most portable, but still does roll pretty nicely. All right. Let's connect you back up here. Locked. Plenty of slack still. Yep. Okay. And just like that. It's backed, backed in there. It is secured. Now you can lock all the wheels, but I don't need to, so. Let's turn it back on. And it registers, yep, all five batteries. Right there, battery times five. Okay. Now we're going to get them all charged up and then...
start using them. Thanks for joining me on this uh, journey. 